Heartbreak is a difficult and painful experience that takes time to heal. Almost everyone in their life suffers from heartbreak. It can be in any form. You can be heartbroken because of a cheater partner or some friend who ditched you and broke your trust. You can be heartbroken because you lost money in business. You can be heartbroken because you've lost your loved ones. Reasons are multiple, but it's important to focus on getting out of it as soon as possible. There are some things you can do to help yourself recover more quickly. It's natural to feel a range of emotions after a breakup including sadness, anger, and fear. Allowing yourself to experience and express these emotions can help you move through them more quickly. It takes time to realize the toxic incident that recently happened to you, but once you realize it, you come to the path of recovery. When you accept with an open heart about that heartbreaking incident and you confess that it's impossible to get back what's been lost, then nothing can stop you from getting out of the trauma. During this difficult time, it's important to take care of your physical and emotional well-being. This may mean getting enough sleep, eating well, and engaging Aging in regular exercise. No matter what bad things come in life, never stop loving yourself. Don't hate yourself because after all, we love ourselves. If we don't take care of ourselves, then how will we take care of our loved ones? Do not take the stress. Do not adopt unhealthy activities because of the pain and depression that the heartbreak has caused. Anything can happen in life, but it doesn't mean to stop loving ourselves. Keeping your mind and body occupied can help distract you from the pain of heartbreak. Engage in activities that you enjoy, such as hobbies, sports, or spending time with friends and family. Working out is a great way to reduce stress. If you feel worried and stressed, do a workout till sweating and your stress will vanish. You can do jogging or play some physical games. It can be helpful to talk to someone about your feelings. Consider reaching out to a trusted friend, family member, counselor, or therapist who can provide professional support. Try to avoid loneliness because it triggers negative feelings and thoughts. We always think negatively when we talk to ourselves, especially after a heartbreak. Be in the company of a best friend or those who support you and make you happy. Be kind to yourself during this difficult time. Remember that it's okay to feel sad and take the time to heal. Try to avoid self-blame or negative self-talk and focus on treating yourself with the same care and compassion you would offer to a friend. Don't be your enemy. Focus on your well-being, your personality, and the people connected to you. Your family will not be happy to see you in stress. Traveling is a great way to reduce stress. Once your place changes, your mind changes, which means your thoughts and feelings get changed. It really helps in recovering from a heartbreak. Don't spend much time in the place which connects you to the heartbreak. Instead, change your place and you'll feel much better and recover much more rapidly. Overall, the key to healing from heartbreak is to be patient with yourself and allow yourself the time and space to grieve and process your emotions. With support and self-care, you will eventually be able to move forward and heal. Self-love and focus on self-evaluation are virtual to recovering from a heartbreak. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Until until next time, stay safe and stay curious.